Hey, what's good, my friend Avram Gonzalez here, jumping over a little stream right here at the, the lake here near Boulder, Colorado, and I'm um, bringing you part two of my Wealth and Abundance uh, video series. And in today's video, I just want to explain to you a very simple, and I got to watch out for some of the mud here. It's a little bit crazy. It's been raining a lot. Um, I want to explain to you a really simple concept that a lot of people forget about when it comes to making money and becoming wealthy. If you don't get this piece, you're going to have a really, really difficult time creating and generating money this lifetime. Okay, um, so I'm gonna give you the simple fact, break it down really easily for you, so you can get how you can duplicate this in your life over and over. See, you have to understand where money comes from. Where does money come from? Okay, money simply comes from other people. You know, when you think about money and where it is, and the banks, and uh, you know, other people's wallets, it's like, where's money? Money's in my wallet right now. Okay, if you want to become wealthy, you have to figure out ways to make people want to give you money right um, of course you like you want to do this this stuff kind of not kind of but you want to do this stuff ethically right you want to give people a real reason to give you money for services exchange what's going on man um, so so what so how does how does this plan how does this pan out man I'm gonna break this down to like four different categories of ways that you can make money you have to understand it comes from other people right people have to make a decision to give you money. Money doesn't just grow on trees, right? You know, it kind of does in the sense that, you know, people, it's everywhere and it can come from anybody. And so here's what you have to do. You have to recognize that money is an exchange. Like making money is an exchange. What can you give people that makes them excited to give you money, right? And, and here's the thing you have to also recognize is that when somebody gives you money in exchange for a service, the reason that they give you money is because they feel that what they're getting from you is of greater value than the money in their pocket. For example, it's like if I had a $5 bill and you had a $5 bill, why would we trade $5 bills? We wouldn't, right? We simply wouldn't because it's the same. There'd be like really no point in trading that money between each other because it's the same value. But let's say you had a $10 or I had a $10 bill and you had a $5 bill and I proposed to trade. You'd be like, yeah, I'm going to get $10 for my $5 bill. Heck yeah, I'm going to do it every single time. Same thing is true with your, with your services, the things that you have to offer to the world. So when you go to an employer, what do you do? You have a skill set, you trade them, but you trade them what you have in exchange for a paycheck, right? Your time, your money, your energy, uh, your skill sets, the things that you're aware of, etc., etc. Here's four different things that you can give people in exchange for money all day long. First one's information. So if you're at like a theme park, you know, and you want to know um, how to get from point A to point B or find your favorite roller coaster, what do you do? You buy a map, right? A map is information. So that's one form of exchange that you can put out into the world that people want to pay for. Second piece of information, education, right? So you think about it, it's like you go to YouTube and you search for videos on how to uh, start a blog or how to tie a tie or how to plant a tomato garden, right? You pay, you pay for and you buy information all the time. Again, more mud here. Woo! To learn how to do something. Okay? That's educational information. You buy this stuff all the time. You buy it when you go get a degree in college. Right? You're paying for an education. Okay? Third thing that people want to pay you money for. Okay? Is entertainment. Right? So it's like, why do people go to the movies? They want to be entertained. Very, very simple. Right? And then the final piece of information is inspiration. Right? People want to be inspired. That's why they go see really inspirational movies. That's why they love uh, inspirational quotes on the internet. That's why um, you know, people simply want to be uplifted, inspired. That's why they go to seminars and all that stuff. So those are like the four different types of things that you can offer the world. I want you to start thinking in terms of the information, education, entertainment, and inspiration that you can give to people that they're going to want to be excited to give you money for. If you understand this principle at its finest and that people will only give you money for things that they feel is of greater value than the money in their pocket, meaning they feel that the money in their pocket is worth less than what you have to offer, they're going to trade you all day long. They're going to give you their money and be excited all day long, right? So let me know in the comments below if you had a breakthrough from this video. Um, let me know what that was, you know, and then like, comment, and share this video with your friends if you found something of value. And um, I hope that you have an amazing day and you, you start integrating this information and recognize that, you know, money is everywhere and that it's a simple exchange of value 
between people, right? The money comes from people. You have to find people that want what you have is when you can make a fortune doing what you love, being in integrity, and uh, changing the world, right? That's, that's what I'm all about. And uh, I'm pretty sure that you're watching this video, you feel the same way too. So like, comment, share this video, and I look forward to seeing you for part three on the very next one. And uh, I don't know if I mentioned this, but I'll put part one in the comments so you can watch that video too. All right, my friend, bye for now.